So I wanted to share this really cool liquid that I have in the lab. It's called ferrofluid. And this ferrofluid is something that becomes very strongly magnetized in the presence of a magnetic field. Ferrofluid is simply these suspended nanoscale particles in a carrier fluid, such as an organic solvent or water. These nanoscale particles are usually iron compounds, such as magnetite or hematite. It's actually the same iron that you can find in beach sand. We also coat those nanoscale particles with a surfactant that will help prevent clumping in that carrier fluid. Now what's really cool are those spikes and peaks that you're seeing forming, or spikes and valleys that you see forming on that ferrofluid. That occurs because of that strong magnetic field. And this is actually known as normal field instability. And that instability occurs by the fluid creating a shape that minimizes the total energy. This is what it's like to walk through an ice cave in Iceland. You're joking! This is a glowing cave of ice, Mike! Go for it. Oh, sweet. Look at that. I was knocked down, heard the countdown through the haze in the face of defeat, yeah. I was ruled out with no bail out on my own, all alone, left to bleed out. But I rose up from the ground, just like I was real bound, all the odds were against me. So I picked up the page, and now. Seven in the kitchen. 
It's a cold. Brand new Lamborghini, a cop car. With a pistol on my hip like I'm a cop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you ever met a real new rock star? This ain't no good talk, this a clock. Cutting on action. Now all this means is cutting from one shot to another while the subject is still in motion. It doesn't always have to be on a punch or a kick. It could be something as simple as a character turning or throwing something or a character going through a door or another door or another door. straight up against the wall, stranglehold with all of my fingers wrapped around her neck. She needs to know how to get out of this. The first part of the technique is to tighten her neck by bringing the shoulders up, chin down. This makes less neck for me to choke, right? So this is a good start. The second thing is she's gonna take what we call a monkey grip, which means a thumbless grip, and she's gonna hook underneath one and over the other. This really secures my arm. If she uses her thumb here, it's a lot easier for me to go into the opening and escape. If she pulls it to her chest here, I'm not going anywhere. Now she breaks back and pulls. And what she's looking for is one individual finger. The idea is to hold that finger tightly and pull it down until the finger breaks. One more time. So here she holds tight with the monkey grip, reaches over the top, breaks whatever finger, and breaks. Doesn't matter if she gets the middle finger, pointer finger, pinky finger, they all hurt the same as far as I'm concerned. So this is a must know technique, last time. Here, boom, holds it, pulls back, and finishes. Joe? Joe? Hey! Get it for the records! 2021! New edition! Oh, baby! <laughs>
keep feeling sorry Don't you look at me like that When you break my heart like that Like you're feeling sorry Cause you're not feeling sorry Hey, hey Don't you look at me like that When you break my heart like that Un elefante muy elegante, la trompa muy larga, la trompa gigante. Uh, muy larga, uh, gigante. Hey, gigante. Hey, no les tengo miedo a los grandes troncos. No tengo miedo de recoger hongos. No les tengo miedo a los chicos rudos. Quita, quita, quita tus escudos Mírame, mira, 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 mira Siénteme y escucho sin mentiras Rainforest, no estoy solo Feel the tropical love, tenemos cuatro horas I like the way you move la trompa Feel the rhythm of jungle bongo I like the way you kiss la boca Let's play the game of love, let's talk Un elefante muy elegante Yeah. 